Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. ATP Monte Carlo Day 1 predictions including Hubert Hurkacz vs. Laszlo Gier, European clay court swing, gets some serious momentum this week, with the first of three clay court masters 1000. It promises to be a fun first day in the principality, and as always, here at LWOT, we will be making our predictions for every first round match. But who will secure a place in the round of 32, at the ATP Monte Carlo Masters somewhat? Surprising given their relatively close age, this is Borna Korak's first meeting with Nicholas Jerry in the professional game, with Jerry looking to return after a surprise defeat in return to winning ways after round one in Marrakesh, but after wowing the crowds by winning the title in Santiago in his native Chile last month, he won't worry too much, if he falls behind Korak here, loss more worrying, the Croatian had a good week in Dubai, and reached the quarterfinals, but that was followed by back-to-back -back defeats at Indian Wells and Miami, which have been happy hunting grounds for him in the past. Prediction, Jerry in 3 This match should make for a fun clash of styles. Mark Andrea Hewisler does not shy away from intervening and dictating. For the Swiss, it is always live with the sword, die with the sword, but that has worked well enough for him over the last 12 months, and he is currently in the top 50. John Muner is naturally more cautious, focusing on relies on solid ground strokes, and excellent court coverage to deliver wins, that has limited his progression in the rankings, with the Spaniard's career best position at number 52 in the world rankings, reflecting his struggles against the best in the game. But this looks like a winnable match for him, Hewisler has the power to pound through Muner, but the Swiss need to paint red on the red sand, and hit the lines. Prediction. Muner in 3 Another surprising first clash will see Hubert Herkic take on Laszlo Gier. Herkic's clay court season got off to a disappointing start when he fell in his opener at Estoril, a defeat that followed early eliminations at Indian Wells and Miami. So, 